Have you ever tasted colorless, transparent tea? Do you know what tea tastes like after being distilled? Today we're going to use a rotary evaporator to distill jasmine tea and see what the tea looks like after distillation. First, we pour the brewed jasmine tea into a container. Remember to discard the first infusion as it contains more impurities and is not ideal for experiments. The equipment we'll be using today includes a 50-liter rotary evaporator, a circulating water vacuum pump, and a low-temperature cooling liquid circulation pump for the condenser. Once everything is ready, we turn on the water bath and set the temperature to 70 degrees Celsius. Next, we turn on the vacuum pump to create a negative pressure inside the rotary evaporator. Using this vacuum principle, we draw the tea into the rotating flask. Then we start the low temperature cooling liquid circulation pump, enable both cooling and circulation, so that the coolant flows through the condenser to cool and condense the steam. As the temperature gradually rises and the pressure in the rotating flask decreases, the liquid begins to boil. At this point, we can see the distilled tea condensing again in the condenser and collecting in the receiving flask. After more than 20 minutes of distillation, a large amount of clear liquid has been collected in the receiving flask. Now it's time to collect the distilled product. First, we open the feed valve to bring the system back to atmospheric pressure. Then we open the bottom discharge valve and collect the liquid into a beaker. Looking through the beaker, we can see that the tea has become colorless and transparent. The distilled jasmine tea has a stronger floral aroma and has lost the original sour and astringent taste of the tea.